Next step is to mount these shopping cart wheels on each side of the blade, one here on the left and the other on the right side. With them I can adjust the blade's height from the ground and also they'll support the blade's weight preventing it from scraping the ground too much. To mount them I have to weld this long knot to the blade's edge right here. To do this I made these small brackets so that I can weld the knot to them and the wheels will be perpendicular to the ground.
I just finished the quick release system. It's got a lever in the in the front, and when it's pressed, it activates a small switch here in the back, and which releases the safety uh, the safety metal plate from here, and the plug can come off easily off the ATV. All I need to do now is just attach one of one of these springs here in the back, so that the safety mechanism will always be on like this, and the plug won't accidentally fall off the ATV. This is the last, so I tell you, my friend. It's all unwritten, but we came to this end. It's sad, it's true, but there's nothing you can do but accept that the world is blue. Moments in life, minutes you paid, fade. Will always be mistakes, nothing right you made. You gave head to the corner in the hall of shame. That be the place where you reach your fame. With a human as a leader on the top of the chain. They want to keep you as a dreamer and cause you the pain. Protect the veins, don't let them rain. There is no way back. You are going insane You have to break safe walls To build up new And be proud if you even get the right to be you Got yourself through There's a heaven on the other side When the world's so wide Where you can forever ride Restless lonely one Commence the holy run The centerpiece you want There's nothing but the sun Okay, so this little spring here gave me a few headaches it's supposed to hold this lever back in, into uh, this position here so it won't accidentally move in the back and uh, causing the blade to change angles obviously it's not a very a very stiff spring you can easily move it with your hand just a little pressure and when it's moved let me put the camera down so I can show this When you pull the lever back, like this, you can easily adjust the blow angle. You can put it at 15 degrees here, or even further at 30 degrees here. Just a second, so it'll tweak it at its first. There you go. Okay, finished. So, all we gotta do now is put... Uh, the front blade back to position and mount the rubber band where the blade is uh, meeting the concrete. Finally the plow is done and let's see a few updates. I had to weld these two brackets here so I can get a better grip on these pedals and another bracket here in the back to prevent this uh, axle from uh, being too flexible. It kept uh, going front and back when I, when I pushed uh, the pedals in front. Except that everything is done. Here's the push tube and of course the plow blade. Well. Let's get them painted. Finally, the blow is finished. All the parts are disassembled right now and painted. I gotta wait for the paint to dry before I start the assembly. Until then, you can check out the first three videos from the Plow Building series by clicking any of these boxes here. Thanks for watching, guys. You're the best.